after a beautiful Saturday with not a cloud in the sky, we are going to be seeing a change of pace for our Sunday. So if you're planning on heading out into the woods again on Sunday, you're going to notice a lot more cloud cover in the sky and you could see a few flakes as well. So we're starting out the morning cloudy, temperatures in the upper 20s, and throughout the morning we do have the chance for some light snow. Fortunately, not going to be incredibly heavy, but could temporarily reduce visibility and enough to drop a little bit of snow for us. And even after that, things stay cloudy. So here's what that looks like. We go through the rest of Saturday night. We start out the night mostly clear, but then cloud cover does increase as that system approaches the area, bringing the most snow to parts of central Minnesota. But even as we head into Sunday morning, you'll notice here, thin band of snow likely going to move through the region, and that could drop a little bit of snow for us, at least through the middle of Sunday and even into the afternoon. Clouds probably going to hang in there, perhaps a light flurry into early afternoon, but really we are going to see things staying rather cloudy through the rest of the day. Things do clear into Monday, though, and we do start the week nice before our next system approaches for Tuesday. As for Sunday's snow, though, again, not looking like we're going to see a ton of accumulation. Most of us are probably going to see anywhere from a few flakes that might stick to the ground up to about a trace or a half inch at most. So again, most of us likely going to be under that half inch threshold. A few isolated higher totals possible, especially closer to Minnesota and into parts of northern Wisconsin where there could be some one to three inch totals. So nothing too significant from that. For tonight, we are looking at increasing clouds, few flakes possible by early Sunday morning. And again, we're going to see that light snow early in the day, mostly cloudy temperatures topping out in the low 40s. And as we head into the rest of the upcoming week, we're dry on Monday. Tuesday is that next system. We'll have more details on that over the next couple of days, but it's looking more likely that we're going to see some wintry precipitation starting as snow potentially changing to rain or mix and also the potential for some accumulation in there again we're going to continue to refine that over the next couple days but then beyond that heading into thanksgiving black friday itself looking like we're going to have a nice calm week temperatures pretty close to average for much of the week anywhere from the upper 30s to low 40s and again dry through the holiday